It started with PNM admitting that it overbilled a couple of hundred customers, but it quickly became clear the company didn't really know how many people it's been overcharging. But it is many more than just a few hundred. Now, a public regulation commissioner wants an investigation. News 13's Amanda Goodman has that live from the Newsplex. Amanda? Well, Dick, the PRC says the inconsistencies are raising serious concerns. A number of customers came forward to us and said, these bills aren't making any sense to us. Those customers live on Santa Fe's west side. When the PRC started looking into it, they found PNM had been overcharging customers there an average of about six bucks a month. They had originally notified us that there would be about 200, and I think the number is 288 customers that had been overbilled. But Commissioner Douglas Howe says PNM kept changing the number. It went up to more than 400, then to 8,000 customers, and most recently down to 3,200. That raises a lot of suspicions and a lot of concerns on our part that uh, PNM may not be forthcoming with all of the numbers on this. Or that PM simply doesn't know themselves. A PM spokeswoman told me over the phone the company's own investigation now puts the final number at 3,280 customers who were overcharged. She says the problem was caused by a meter reader who failed to read his meters properly. That employee is responsible for 8,000 meters. PM claims the total amount overbilled was about $20,000 and it will credit customers on their next bill. But Howe's not satisfied. At the next PRC meeting, he will ask for a formal investigation. Asking them to provide us detailed information on exactly who was affected, why this situation occurred, exactly how the refunds are going to be calculated for each and every one of the customers who are affected. PNM could not tell me exactly how long this employee had been reading meters inappropriately, but they believe it was at least a few months. The utility says the issue has been resolved. Dick, back to you. All right, Amanda PNM also says it welcomes a PRC investigation that the company has nothing to hide.